How's it going my fellow Casanovians? This is PC Casanova bringing you the videos you love. And uh, I set my audio source for the wrong... Yep, I don't have any uh, microphone audio. Really annoyed right now, but I guess that gives me the opportunity to try something different with this video. So uh, yeah, this is the Forgotten City. And uh, it's basically a whole game that was made out of a, a story that was made within the with Skyrim. And it was a big quest mod that was very popular. And for the longest time, they were, um, they were working on making their own game outside of the creation engine. And they uh, did it. And it. Well, I or I'm in from the future from after recording hours of microphone audio live yeah but you get to experience the game and watch the video <laughs> hope you enjoy hey you're alive when I dragged you out of the river, I thought you were never going to wake up. I checked your pockets for ID, a phone, maybe. I hope you don't mind. But all I found was some loose change. So, wanna tell me who you are? I, of course, decided to name myself something unique and creative. Well, it's nice to meet you. And I'm sorry to pry, but any idea why you were floating down the river? What's the last thing you remember? How would I not want to start with a boomstick? That is like... Do you know me? I, you might not if you uh, got recommended this video. Uh, if that's the case, then... Uh, really? You're bye. a soldier? <laughs> but... Uh, Why but, are you yeah. out of uniform? I went with the boomstick. Oh, was it a black op? If you're reading this, it means I've discovered the entrance to an ancient Roman city hidden deep underground. Its existence is long forgotten. All knowledge of it lost, except in the Latin inscription. <laughs> here it reads you who wish to enter the city step forth and be judged the virtuous shall be rewarded with eternal life in paradise the wicked shall find themselves showered in gold but in vain for this shall be their final resting place could an underground city have remained a secret for all this time could people have survived down there against the odds it seems there's only one way to find out if I'm not back in an hour I'm somewhere on the other side consider this an invitation or a warning Al Worth to whoever reads this I'm sorry you had to find me like this and worse you'll suffer the same fate I did. I spent a lifetime in this place, going around and around in circles, searching for a way out. The inscription was right. There is no way back. And here there are only two options. Death, and that godforsaken doorway into the past. I made the mistake of stepping through it. I wanted to set things right, and I tried. I really tried. Whatever I did, it took me right back to the beginning. Don't make the same mistake. Better to end it all now, and find out what awaits you beyond that portal. Should be a warning when we go to the past anyway. And we're now entering the Twilight Zone.
I did what any reasonable person would do as soon as they step through a time portal. Shoot the first motherfucker the they lay eyes on. Suffer for the sins oh, of the one. fuck Christ. I'm great at game. Right. Thought I was in here alone. I'm out. Well, here I am. I'm sorry, I didn't catch your name. Funny you should ask. I was just reading an old tablet I found here. Well, trying. My Latin is kind of rusty, but the last entry mentioned someone with the same name. It described an event about 2,000 years ago. Someone with your name appeared in the city out of the shrine of Proserpina and murdered a local magistrate, breaking some kind of ancient law. It said that the voice of a furious god rang out, and the ground trembled and statues sprang to life, firing arrows at the city's inhabitants. Apparently, as the citizens screamed and died in pain, the stranger just vanished in a flash of light. I didn't for one moment think it was, but the way you say that makes me wonder. I mean, how many people with that name could there be in this place? I don't understand how you could have been here 2,000 years ago. Uh, I'm sorry, come again? Um, let me see that. God, why does this writing look so familiar? I've spent a lifetime in this place going around and around in circles. This is... Uh, this is disturbing. But I don't understand how I could have written it. I... Uh, I'm not following. So you're saying, because a man from 2,000 years ago is dead, he never created a time portal, so I never went through it, and that's why I don't remember any of this. I guess... So what you're really saying is, you brought me back from the dead to let me die all over again. You saw the tablet. I spent a lifetime searching for a way out and never found one. I can't see how I could possibly find one now, so it seems like we're both going to die here. How can you say that? You murdered a man in cold blood, and now there's a city full of dead people. It's only a matter of time before we join them. I guess all those old Latin inscriptions were right. Pro peccata unius multis dolabat. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. I think that was the true canon ending, and probably the best ending, so... Uh, yeah, see you in the next video. Bye. Love is a bird. Uh, Salve, friend. I'm Galerius. Mind telling me who you are and what you were doing in the Shrine of Proserpina? I'm speaking Latin. You are too, although your accent's a little strange. Oh, I see what you did there. Yeah, you know, agricultural goddess of springtime? You're not from around here, are you? And you've just done it again. You're a sly one, aren't you? One more time, who are 
are you, and what were you doing in that shrine? Uh, no, you know, not right in the head. <sighs> That's all right, friend. We sort of lose track of a date down here, but it feels... It's 817 AUC. Sorry, you look confused. 817 years since the founding of Rome. Which part of the Empire are you from, exactly? Hey! Not so loud! Just saying that name could land you in trouble here. If you haven't heard, his cultists burned down half of Rome last year. Horrible business. I heard Nero executed some of them, but a lot of people are still angry with them. Even down here. So, if you're one of them, keep it to yourself. But, listen, most folks seem a bit confused when they get here, but you... you seem very lost, and in more ways than one. So, let me make this nice and simple for you. Live by our law here, and we'll all get along just fine. Not laws, law. There's just one, the golden rule, and the punishment for breaking it's... Well, it's kind of horrific. But our magistrate insists we take all newcomers to see him, so I guess I'll let him fill you in. So then, are you coming? Follow me. When I first arrived, I couldn't believe there were people living down here. But I did a bunch of see, trying to do a side quest, but eventually I got back to the main quest. So, uh, yeah, here it is. A curious name, to match a curious accent. But I digress. I see you have the posture of a soldier, though I've not seen that in a woman before. You must be of the Amazonian people. I pray to Mars your skill set won't be necessary here, but time will tell. Now, you're probably wondering why I summoned you, and a secret city built deep in the... Indeed. More importantly, consider 22 complete strangers brought together by the fates, living and working together. And in all that time, not a single sin has been committed. No fights, no theft, nothing. Have you ever witnessed something so extraordinary as a city without sin? Well... I'm not sure I believe that. I was kind of just caught up in the lore. So I just kind of talked to him for a while. So I'm just uh, skipping past it real quick. But basically he just talked about how I got here. And uh, how he summoned me. And the paradoxes and all that fun stuff that comes when you have time travel I guess. But uh, yeah get back to the gameplay. What have you discovered? Oh. Of course. What have you discovered? Yes. that thing if you kill me, allow me to explain the crux of it is the, to illustrate if you manage to succeed the same thing would happen if you say if either of those things were to happen I am given to understand you would be flung back to your indeed thank you Right. Well, it was lovely to meet you. I look forward to getting to know you better over the coming months. And if you ever... I can't believe this is how it ends. Oh, no. No. No, 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 no. Wolf Pierce, what are you doing? Get back from there. If you lose your balance, you'll fall. That's the idea. What? Why do you... I know. Please. I'm sorry, but I... Please, I'll help him. I am out. Wherever you are. Scintilla, my love. I'm sorry. Oh, 
Snowpierce, no! I... I'll have to let and I... So guys, we did it. We reached a quarter of a million subscribers. Did you just leap into my villa from the balcony a hundred feet above? That was either... Well, why? Of course not. Look, if you're trying to find her, you may wish to... Of course, just to be clear... You mean... Wait... Don't tell me you've fallen. The person making a claim bears the onus of proving that claim. Can you do that? As you wish. I'm afraid not. I'm Maliolus. I'm glad you asked. These good people. By the... I trust you can through the door this time. The many shall suffer for the sins of the one. There's a lot more to this recording, but, um... A lot of it just doesn't make sense without my audio. So I'm going to sum it up on, in my next episode of this game. If I can find something that's usable within this audio, I'll reference to it in the next episode. But a lot of stuff does happen. It's just It's annoying that I didn't have the mic on the right channel, even though I was talking the whole time. But I'm going to end the episode here. Uh, there's a lot of stuff that I probably did do that you want me to try, but if there's anything that you want me to try, or if you anything anything you want to see, let me know, but I hope you enjoyed the video. Don't forget the sus cribe. That's not a reference to Among Us. I've been saying that for years now, but yeah, don't forget the sus cribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Goodbye. Is a burning thing And it makes A fiery ring Bound By wild desire I fell into a ring of fire